welcome to Sal's Classic Bodybuilding Archives. Today's episode is a special request, and we're going to go back to Muscle Mag International, April 1975, where Reg Park shows you how to develop barn door wide deltoids. Enjoy. Before sitting down to write an instructive article of this nature, it is necessary to call upon one's own experiences and, if possible, the experience of others with whom one may have been associated or come into contact with through one's career in bodybuilding. Reflecting on my own beginning, I recall clearly having always been interested in physical exercise and sports. By the time I was 17, I was 6'1", and weighed about 160 pounds. I was a slim muscular lad, very lean and angular looking. It was at this time that I met a fellow named Dave Cohen who introduced me to my first barbell workout. I recall performing strain arm barbell pullovers on the floor, barbell press on back on floor, we did not know about the bench press or pullovers on a bench in those old days. Barbell press, barbell curls, barbell triceps pushaways. The exercises were performed three sets of 10 reps. And as you can see, the first three exercises all worked the shoulders to a marked degree. An interesting point is that I hated the press mainly because I was not strong in it, but I enjoyed the other two exercises. From the age of 18 to 20, my training was interrupted. During that period, I served as physical training instructor for the Malaya Army in Singapore. And whilst I got plenty of exercise, I had virtually no access to barbells. However, during this time, my weight went up to 200 pounds. Upon being demobbed or discharged from the army, perhaps the most significant experience in my short life to that date happened. Just two weeks later, I was amongst the audience of the 1948 Mr. Universe, where I saw Grimmick and Reeves both of whom inspired me to emulate their achievements in the field of bodybuilding. From then onwards, I started training in earnest in an excellent equipped homemade gym on the lawn of my parents' home. Training had changed considerably in the two years I had been in the army. Flat bench and incline bench had been introduced and as a result, my training took on an entirely different slant. It was as follows. 1. Incline bench press with dumbbells, 5x5. Five 5. 2. Flat bench press with dumbbells, 5x5. Five 5. 3. Push-ups. Feet raised with a partner pushing down on the back, 5x10. 4. Barbell standing press, 5x5. Five 5. Press behind neck, 5x5. Five five. 6. Standing two dumbbell press, 5x5. Five five. 7. Chins, and then on to back and the remainder of the body. I would say the area that improved more than any other was without doubt my deltoids. And from actually hating pressing movements, I grew to like them. I suppose it is not surprising that as my deltoids improved, I worked them more and more. I would like to stress that the chest exercises that I performed gave me such an outstanding front deltoid development that when I did a back deltoid arm pose, they were much higher than the other bodybuilders of that time who had relied more on lateral movements and lighter movements. Early in 1960, I was asked to appear in a series of Hercules films in Italy. I had heard rumors that Steve Reeves had not had much opportunity to train whilst filming there, so one of the first matters I took up with the producer and director 
was the question of being able to keep in shape. Our talks resulted in a 330 pound Olympic barbell set arriving on the set next day. I have continued to train regularly since 1948 and my present shoulder exercises are as follows. 1. A barbell press on an upright bench, 5 sets of 5 to 10 repetitions. 2. Press behind the neck, 5 sets of 5 to 10 repetitions. 3. Two dumbbell press, 5 sets of 5 to 10 repetitions. 4. Either standing two dumbbell laterals or lying face downwards, two dumbbell raise backwards for the rear deltoids. I use the bench so as to avoid a strain to the lower back and to avoid the stomach muscles being pushed out and there is no standing balance problem at all which enables me to give maximum effort and concentration to what I am trying to achieve and that is developing my deltoids. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Please leave a like, comment, share and subscribe. I would appreciate it. And until the next video, keep training and chasing the dream.